Hello one and all, welcome back to the channel. This is going to be episode number 8 of Let's Play Marvel Spider-Man 2 on PlayStation 5 with your host Prince Quince. So we're going to go ahead and switch back to... Mm, do we want to do lights, camera? Let's switch back to, to uh, Pete. See what's going on with him. Yeah, I got this new suit. Hey Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from NJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA level stuff. Yeah, whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader, some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. Um, if I can get the story on the front page, it might help us track her down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Oops, nope, I meant to... Shit. Go the other way. I keep trying to... In, in the first game, you could easily, um... Like, hit triangle. And um you know, go into a uh go into the match. But uh, on this one it's a little different. Carry enemies, okay. Oh shit, damn, bitch. Okay. Oops, I fucked that up. Do you think you're Damn. One more. Okay, got it. I to loop some ass. Oh shit. That's not my see before. Gotcha, bitch. Gotta patch up that tanker fast. Ooh. At least my suit's heat nice. shielding still works well. Who the hell is beeping at me? What, bitch? Spider Man, yeah. motherfucker. What? I see you in the car, ma'am. Still beeping. Oh, you a hoe. Everybody know. Chief Clark, everything okay? We we're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely. Oops, I guess we're hanging up the phone call. I was wondering what this place was. Time to do some Peter Parker work, not as Spider-Man. That's Emily's tree. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? Green Goblin hit ass. It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. I ain't agreed to nothing yet. You got a particle acceler accelerator? That's fucking crazy. Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh, really? But I was gonna give him a tour. 
let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. I don't see why he doesn't have it clipped on him. I guess he did just walk so in. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Enjoy your coffee, Dad bitch. went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... She got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. Interesting to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yeah. This is Catherine, who may I ask is calling? Let's check this out. Let's see what's going on. That data does not cross tabulate with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. What up, you? I think what you'll up, like this up, project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, bee we wolf. developed an innovative way to help the bees. Sounds crazy. Wanna see how? I hope werewolf went out of a fucking bee wolf. Whoa, this is cool. Um, These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wolves. And you're helping so. with the machine learning algorithm. Can you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting, uh, okay, the let's better get our some. drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not to. Oh, nice! Yes. It's kind of fun, actually. Yep. Two more. One and two. Oh yeah! This is green thing. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. I'm done. Let's play We've some got more. Great data. Okay, flying home. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe oh, if Pete decides to join excited. us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. All right, Harry, what's I've next? I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. Kind of busy, Miles. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. What's in here? <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Ooh, Connors. Uh, you can get ass. Can. Wait a sec. It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. He don't remember. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains. Anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. I mean, it seems like he's okay, I guess. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in <laughs> second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. Let's check some shit out. Oh, this is the hand. So that was crazy. 
But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess What's I'll this? look around. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Snoopin. Oh, yeah, Snoopin. Take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. Oh, we have one. Well, Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses okay. 3D printing technology to create um, a Let's go over here. What up, lady? Drones. Damn. Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Okay. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. I need to go to the other target. The other blue thing. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Welcome Did it start paying off the mortgage? I was gonna come here first. Uh, what if Spidey work gets in the way? I gotta go back gotta over there. What through the before fuck? signing on. Okay. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. Wonder how it ended up here. That don't sound good. Something back over here I need to get. This fucking came from over here. This is the same lady. It's the same lady. Alright, I'm just gonna go meet up with Harry. Oh, damn There's it. so much to way. explore! But I shouldn't keep Harry waiting. Came around the steps. Come on, Pete. Particle accelerator. Shouldn't this thing be underground? You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. It sounded like it was, you know, back up. Yeah, I feel like this just should Where be underground. Now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school to middle school. Okay. Please. Now, do you know the. Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. How would I feed the so fish? So calming and sounds like random. We're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. Move, brother. I see what you're saying. The Damn, yeah, yeah. Out of the way. Long division. Uh, if you look at it that way. If Got you it. look at it that mm -hmm. way. Dr. Foster. Those ears, Thanks, Dr. bro. Foster. Those ears. Ah, oh, Peter, Damn. I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. I need to get closer look Dr. at these Foster ears. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural Sheesh. efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Sure. 
Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you don't practice on this? What okay. I'm doing. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I, I think I get it. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Don't think that goes there. Um. Maybe here. Let's see. Cool. So I think I'm matching up the colors, like the lines that are, you know, in One the corners. I'm trying to, to match up those lines. Nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. I need a sun. Uh, let's get some more water. Oh, I can only use what? Okay. So I can't use that. That'll work. Hmm. Nope. Maybe something like this, but I have too many now. And the water won't connect, right? These bitches are tricky. And the water, awesome. I still gotta use the rest of them, oops. Had I but known. Beautiful work, Peter. I thought I only had to use the ones that they were asking for. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Cool. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Foster. <laughs> the so now we're just last skipped. Stop. Might or be my it, um, instead of saying asset, it said you'll be a real ass Playful, here. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember. The things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? Kinda gotta call we'll Miles, to get in. though. I like your hair, homie. I like your curls. I don't see why wow. they have handles if, I guess for exiting, you need the handles to push out, but I guess the handle shouldn't be on the outside if you can just badge in and they automatically open. Man. Harry. 
This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? <laughs> I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> That's kind of cool. <laughs> Damn, he's blowing you. Blowing I, I'm, your I'm phone gonna need up, Peter. a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Out of your tutoring? Uh oh. Of course. Take whatever Wait. time you need. You ain't trying to be Spider Man no it's more. It's all about balance, right? Is that what he means? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> Stay on trust you, Harry. I forgot to tell you, some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. Nice. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the locations, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Level 11. Um, it said try some, try hey, some new suits. Sorry, I didn't so get I back might to change before, my but suit. I was. I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's, it's incredible. Oh, but I can fill you in later. You. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. What is this? Dr. Foster doesn't mind it. Oh, some more of the, uh... Oh, okay, never mind. Excited to have you on board. We've partnered with your friends at Feast to feed the community, starting by improving our gardens. To help, please collect some samples of nearby plants and put our gene splicer to use. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. Um, going there has here. to be a healthy looking plant around here somewhere. These are clearly more efficient with water. I can use that. Really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. Get some samples. <laughs> this one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Okay, got oh, some shit. great samples. Time to bring them together. Oh, now I gotta do the fucking gene splicing thing again. Damn it. I can't believe that EMF is making these GMOs open source.
Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Let's see. Knocking it out of the park. I can't wait to see this grow. Get you some. I just gotta do one. I probably gotta do three. Probably one for each of the plants. Oh, okay. Oh. Made some cool. great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. <laughs> Oops. Uh, heading back over here. Yeah, I just gotta patch this up. Oops. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Gotta take care of those boxes to get to that leak. Just a few more to patch up. Damn. Quite a bit. By that car. Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. May used it? to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? I hear it. I just don't see the last one. Up here. This is kind of hidden. This should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He Ooh. doesn't need to know Spider Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. Okay. Um. Speaking about suits, let's go ahead and get a new suit. Oh, cool. Amazing Spider Man, Amazing 2 Spider Man suit. Oh, this looks pretty badass. I might get. This. I wonder what colors this comes in, but I'm, I'm not gonna get it just yet. You know what? Let's just go ahead and blue and red. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Cool. All right, we're going to go ahead and end it here. So thank you so much for staying tuned to another episode of Let's Play Marvel Spider-Man 2 on PlayStation 5 with your host, Prince Quince. Until next time, deuces.